Let me share with you a story that will illustrate a mistake that most entrepreneurs make. My name is Gordon Duncan, I own Capitalized Marketing and Consulting, and today I'm driving my old beat up Honda Accord. Look at this, because my daughter in high school, she doesn't have her license yet, and this is gonna be her car, so I always drive it to pick her up. Story. Okay, so when I got started, my first business was an optometric consulting business. I had been a manager of a 14,000 patient clinic, and I did everything but look at the eyeballs, hired, fire, profit, all that stuff. And so I wanted to start an optometric consulting business. So I got some business cards printed up, and I went and got a cell phone. Uh, it's 2003. Because the cell phone I had at that time was the, the clinic cell phone. So I went and got my own cell phone, and I got some business cards. Um, but then how do I get started? So I went to uh, an optometrist on the other side of town. Um, his name was Rosie. And I said, hey, Rosie, I need a favor. I was like, can I come and I spend an entire day in your office, just observe everything, and I'm going to write up suggestions that I would make and implement if you hired me as a consultant, and I'm not going to charge you a single thing. And he's, yeah, sure, Gordon. And so I spent the whole day, I followed him, I followed his staff, I asked a ton of questions. Then I went and took an hour and I typed up all the notes and I sat down with Rosie. And I was like, hey, Rosie, thank you so much. I appreciate you giving me time. I want to share with you uh, what, what I would suggest. And he said, Gordon, I don't want to look at it. And man, when he told me that he didn't want to look at it, I thought I had really made a mistake. He goes, I don't need to look at it. I'll tell you what, if you need me to be a referral source for you, you just let me know. I was like, Rosie, thanks, you're the best. Now, I don't know if he just liked me or if he observed what I had done for the day, but I owe Rosie a ton. So then what I did is I reached out to um, an optical lens salesperson. There's a bunch of people in the industry. And I said, hey, do you know anybody that could use a, um, you know, uh, an optometric consultant that's pretty affordable? And he said, you know, I think I do. I'll get back in touch with you. Well, the next thing you know, I got a phone call and they said, hey, you need to call this doctor in this county. I told him that you were going to call and uh, see what we're going to do. So I did it. I called him up and I said, hey, um, Gordon Duncan, optometric consultant. And he said, yeah, yeah, I heard you might be coming by. Come by this afternoon. So I put my suit on and I went and sat down and I made him my pitch. And man, I was super affordable. I think I was like $350 a day. It was like 2003 and told him my pitch told him what I was going to do and he said I don't know where this boldness came from but he said you know what Gordon um, I don't need you um, we're not you know not broke we're not going out of business uh, I, I just don't really think you can help us and you know what I said to him I said good I'm glad you're not broke and going out of business I don't know if I could help you but if you want to make some money you should hire me and you know what he hired me and I worked with him for the next six or seven months. So here's a couple of things that young entrepreneurs often miss. First, I worked for free. I did, I worked for free. And the people I worked for free for, I asked them, would you be a reference for me? A person who would say, hey, I vouch for Gordon. Then I went for referrals in the industry that I was in. I was like, hey, can you put it together? Because that created a warm lead for me. I wasn't doing cold calling. And so with that referral that Rosie said he would be for me and that warm lead, I was a consultant for this doctor and we worked together for like six or seven months. Uh, I had a great relationship with him. I could call him up today. But if you're getting started, starting your own business, don't just declare yourself an expert. Do some free work to get a referral. Then get warm leads. Who will talk for you? And then when you've got that reference, you've got that warm lead, you got a better chance of getting your first gig. So again, my name is Gordon Duncan. I'm the owner of Capitalized Marketing and Consulting. Uh, we can help you in your marketing and even better yet, we can come inside and coach you to get new leads and grow your revenue. If you need any help, just reach out to me. Thanks for this story. Now I'm going to go pick up my daughter.